Hey everybody, um, got a DJF Phantom 4 and I've tried a few different tablets uh, to use as the monitor for the device and came to the Samsung S2. Uh, I tried the Tab A 8 inch, it was great, but some of the functionality did not work with the DJI Go app. Um, I could not post a video uh, and uh, right from the tablet, from the down feed video and the signal strengths were not coming up into uh, the DJI Go app and it was just a functional functionality of the tablet itself so I traded it in and it got the Samsung Galaxy S2 uh, I really like the tablet, it's got a great screen um, good size, fast processor runs the apps very clean and very smooth uh, but one problem I've had is linking it and uh, getting the signal from the DJI uh, Go app to the controller. And it was a hit and miss, it wasn't consistent. I would get it sometimes, do the same sequence with uh, turning on the controller, turning on the fan himself. And sometimes it would link, sometimes it wouldn't. And uh, so it was very frustrating until I came up uh, with a sequence that is pretty much foolproof and apparently what happens is the Samsung Galaxy uh, S2 gathers that information into the cache I believe as far as uh, if the device stores the memory of what it connects to it actually stores it and sometimes it doesn't want to keep it and uh, it gets confused and therefore it doesn't make the link so there is a sequence here that is pretty much foolproof and once you do this a couple times it will run very clean for you. Uh, I do have to mention that I did reinstall the DJI Go app four or five times, uh, formatted uh, the Samsung Galaxy and did all the rigmarole of trying to debug this and this is what works. So the first thing you do is make sure that you are tethered the tablet to the controller and do a cold boot of the tablet and even though this is a pain in the butt this does work and once you do this a couple times I believe that the cache stores this uh, the tablet to the controller and makes things easier in the long run so that you can get away with not having to do a cold boot with it tethered all the time so as soon as this loads up, you can uh, proceed. Let's see here. Again, Samsung Galaxy Tab S2 is a great device. Very fast, very clean, very sharp. Um, does everything I want it to do. Uh, plays videos. Very crisp. I believe it does uh, play in 4K. Um, I only shoot in 1080 60p but this does work very, very clean. Once we have the tablet fully booted with it connected to the remote, we're going to turn on the Phantom. Now we're going to turn on the radio. Very important that you do not want to hit the checkbox. You always want to hit OK. DJ Go Apple Connect, and there you go. It is now connected to the camera. From here, you do the typical hit the camera, and everything should be good to go. Now, once this is connected, you really don't have to do this every single time. Um, so if, say, I turn the Phantom off, and now it obviously it says no signal, close the app, just kill it all the way across, turn off the radio, Let's do it soft, shut down, turn it back on. Let's try it again. Good turn on the phantom. And 
again, turn on the radio. It's always difficult for me to turn on a, a bird without the radio on, but this is what works for the Phantom. And again, camera will work. Let's do something a little bit different now. Let's turn the Phantom off. Let's unplug. Disconnect the controller. Close the app. I'm going to unhook the tablet. We are now going to turn the radio on. This is what the manual says to do. Turn the Phantom on. And now we are going to connect the tether to the radio. Now you gotta wait for that screen to pop up. And if it doesn't pop up, it's not going to engage it. So it's obviously not showing up. So if I hit the DJI Go app, it will not connect to the Phantom 4. So let's go a different way. Let's turn the Phantom off. And I have done this literally a thousand times, different sequences to figure out what works and what does not. So again, there's no apps running. Turn the Phantom on. It is tethered. Turn the radio on. That flashed a couple times, but I'm going to hit OK now. Good to go. So, hope this helps for you. I spent a couple days on this. I was about to return the uh, tablet and get something different. Um, heaven forbid, get something uh, from Apple, but I love the tablet. I'm glad to figure out this, uh, this sequence, and it seems to be working okay for me now. So, hope this helps you out. Thank you. Good luck. Fly safe.